Ah, so this looks like it's over 500 TV difference, but he must have journeyman, right? This must be it. He must have journeyman. So let's see how many he's got. Yes, he does. Four, four uh, two. But it's still a hefty, still a hefty TV advantage. <laughs> he's got strip though. I really need to show hands, don't I? Fuck's sake. I need a show hands guy. Pretty quickly. I guess the other strength four guy can just get show hands. Um... He's gonna get a wizard and stuff, isn't he? Hello, Grindel. Hello, Jellio. Hello, Skurimetsu. Yeah, play-by-play -play recap. Honestly, not not much happened. Um... <laughs> Never win his data can't save him in the cage. <laughs> um, yeah, you know, nothing was ever really gonna. It wasn't gonna fucking solve world peace or anything, was it? Last night, but um. Yeah, it was just the unfortunate thing was Nethios's mic not working very well. That was that was the unfortunate thing because I just literally couldn't really hear anything he said. <laughs> so no, I actually looked at his records. He's got Eldril, a wizard, and a stripper, so he's he's got a chance. To be fair, he's got he's got a chance. No, <laughs> TV his TV Plus would have, <laughs> would have gotten him a million inducements. If this was matched by TV Plus, like full TV Plus, then um, I'd be plus 11, so I'd be 550 more. And uh, and he'd be 100 less, so he'd get 650 more inducements if this was actually proper TV Plus. Though, of course, if it was proper TV Plus, I would never get to plus 11 wins. So... <laughs> Pedro, <laughs> that's brilliant. That is absolutely brilliant, and that is the analogy, really. I mean, that is the correct analogy. It, like, you know, it's not about starting blocks. You know, you could say that it's not fair that you saying Bolt wins every time in races. I know he's retired, but if you go back in time a little bit, you could say it wasn't. It wasn't. Um, it wasn't fair that he won every time. So you could have a staggered start, but. The, the actual baseball bat analogy is much more realistic because they have more kill skills because they have more TV and they just brutalise your team and there's no there's no skill involved. There's no playing around mighty blow and guard, is there? You know? Especially for bash teams. It's a bit different between bash and Naji, but then it's your fault if you take a bash team to be fair. Yeah, it was, yeah. I thought it was good. I thought it was good for what it was, yeah. I mean it was never gonna be it was never gonna set the world on fire, was it? But I thought it was good for what it was, yeah, absolutely. It was it was as good as it possibly could have been. I think. I think it. Uh, yeah, I think it went. <laughs> no average rise because you, know, you would not get the plus eleven. I don't think anybody on earth would get the plus eleven wins in TV plus. Uh, maybe if they got lucky against shitters, but really, was it Huanchi? Because they said that. Um, he said that he wasn't allowed to talk about future events. That, that's what somebody said. When somebody mentioned that. When somebody mentioned... Uh, I'm going to be a proper shitter here. <laughs> oh, good. Frenzy, hasn't he? Yeah.
<laughs> Go get them, big boy, show them. No mercy, we want a pitch clear. <laughs> oh, God, big boy. Big boy's the greatest. All right, protect the ball first. Good. I'm putting him up there and get pinned in the sideline, but that's okay if that's what he wants to spend his time doing, isn't it? Nice, there's a bit of a screen. Oh, do you know what? Nah, it's too easy to get around. Yes! <laughs> well, why they do have the bankroll, yeah, yeah, exactly, Tony. It's just dumb. It's because I'll tell you, I'll tell you exactly why. And uh, <laughs> it may not help the old. Uh, oh, you can, you can surf by just uh, getting rid of his tackles on, so I can't actually guard the, the sidelines very well um, it may not it may not be the smartest thing to do to well, no, I'm, not, I'm not insulting Dode but for some reason Dode worships the Blood Bowl Rules Commission and acts like you know acts like they're infallible basically I don't know why but he does he really fucking does he can't deny it he, he loves the BBRC and bloody Galax Star Scraper of the Blood, B Blood Bowl Rules Commission won't fucking let it go. He got, he got a, you know, Jervis Johnson. If the... Big Boy isn't on the autism spectrum, <laughs> then no one is. Um. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't understand the word he said. That's... Yeah, why well, stop with what he team for when you do down the tree field, yeah. Feels bad for him now. Um, you know, that was it. And then he just wouldn't go... You know, Jervis Johnson, the, one of the best games designers of all time. Miniatures board game designers of all time. And he just said, you guys, do what you want. Do all the playtests and everything, though, because I don't trust you because you're shitheads. But I'll trust, I'll trust your playtesting. And then... Um, I'll trust your playtesting... So if we can come up with some rules. They came up with some rules and then Jervis Johnson was like, nah mate, nah fam, this bank rule's shit. I'll tell you what, I'll just think of this other rule. And he thought of petty cash. And he thought of that instantly. After they had spent years or months, whatever, testing this bank rule. And fucking Gallic Starscraper, instead of just fucking let it go, he could, you know, he, Gallic Starscraper should have let it go. And he should have accepted defeat, but instead, he refused to shut up about the fact that Bank was play tested, and it was good. And then he was just bitter and twisted that Jervis Johnson had fucking, you know, had refused to do what he wanted, and he would not shut up about it. Would not let it go, and uh, and then there uh, you go. For some reason, Dold fucking thinks he's. He know he's got a clue what he's talking about, but let me tell you, he doesn't have a clue what he's talking about. <laughs> yeah, Galaxy Starscraper. What, what's his name? Paul Anders or something? I should I should call him that. If you want, Mr. Anderson, whatever the fuck his name is. <laughs> there is no other way. Good thing I don't want him before. It's, it's always a thing to celebrate, last frog man. <laughs> I think it's Paul Anders. 
He made like some other game afterwards, like fucking I don't know what it's called. But some game. But yeah, if he if he had just fucking accepted defeat on the bankroll, it would have never been mentioned ever again. But he uh he just wouldn't give up the fact. Oh man, he frenzy trapped himself there for no reason. I think that's why he's lost one, 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 lost two, right? That was that was just that was just wrong. There's very few things you can say are wrong, but that was just clearly, absolutely, unequivocally wrong, wasn't it? <laughs> Paul McGraw. No, no, it is Paul Anders. I mean, he's, he's he's put himself out there, but yeah, that's. That's that's what I think is the is the worst that he just wouldn't fucking let it go and then yeah I don't know I don't know why but Dold is always like they play tested it for years and it's like I don't I don't give a fuck mate it's you know petty cash is, and no bank rule has worked fine on fumble in actual matches you know played by thousands of people way more way more games than his fucking testing ever got you know and uh, it's like. It's, it works. It, it just works, doesn't it? There's no, there's no argument about whether whether it works or not. Just quietly, I'm wrecking this guy. Stand him up because even nah. I don't like how fucking how exposed this side is. I'm gonna go for the dodge out. I even want to reroll it to be honest. It's too it's too weak. <laughs> I give his string. Yeah. So he goes for the fireball. But all he's gonna get is a strip attempt, isn't it? And luckily it's still screened, thanks to making that dodge out. So I did fuck up moving that guy in. I just thought he can stand there, but I, I shouldn't have done. Two men up, unbelievable. Making two cars in two turns, in three to two cars in three turns from from claw mighty blow hits is just fucking out of this world, isn't it? Big boy's in here, and he? he's on it. He could get a bunch of touchdowns. Get guard. Nice tree if I go going for sure. Hands would be okay. So his wizard's wasted. Why well, dodge Maggie? I can't. Because I've I've realised he had a wizard and Eldril and war dancers <laughs> and I just thought it was too exposed there, you know. If if he hadn't if he wasn't here, I shouldn't have moved I moved these guys which I shouldn't have moved in retrospect. But I just felt it was just too weak to a wizard. A wizard in cages down. So I just thought I had to dodge and I had to succeed. So it was a bad play by me. Cricket scores are very, very, very high in Prill this but this won't be a cricket score. It'll be <laughs> one or two nearly <laughs> or two one if whatever, you know. Hopefully. Inarian gets cricket scores. I try not to. Just to just to prevent against uh, Eldril and shenanigans. He can he can get lucky, can't he? At the end of the day. I'm not really doing it to protect against the loop. It's more about you know his recovery after he strips, and all that kind of sh all that kind of shit. If 
for instance, now this guy is coming out. If he manages to do all of these blocks all around here, then maybe he can get through, but I don't think he can do all that. Yeah, it was a bad fireball. But it, it could have been a good one, he could have hit different squares. In there. If I hadn't made that dodge, he could have had a much better payoff from the fireball. And especially with Eldril. And uh, how many of the people? Like I'm, I'm not, I'm not. I don't think he's, you know, particularly good or anything. But I just thought it was worth doing. I mean, well, it wasn't worth doing. I should have, I should have positioned better. But I thought it was worth doing a salvage position. Unfortunately, making him roll some two plus isn't the best. If they uh, make them, is it? But if they fail, it's pretty good. All right, now I'll get, I'll get blocks and everything. Mm. Oh, 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 get pushed on. I kind of want to blitz him to come forward, but I guess it's not going to get me that much forward, is it? So, maybe it is better to blitz him. Let's try to pack them in tight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's frog man. <laughs> three blocks, three pushes. Mm. Get fucked on AV7. <laughs> I thought he'd re roll that dodge away, like, but it turns out to be a, a good one to not re roll. Duck more central now, which is better, isn't it? Especially against a frenzy. But it makes it harder for him to L screen both sides and that. The other book got died, Devil's Eye. He got minus movement, so I just sucked him. <laughs> no, Bubba Hotep, I hate, I hate Woodies and would never ever play them for any price. <laughs> yeah, I'm not right, Mr. Yemenda. VIP, Mr. Yemenda. This might be a minus three, I know he's gonna push and hit from there. Alright. Will he re-roll that or not? <laughs> Pick your skull your skull, you bastard. Oh god, surf him as well. Oh god, that's so that's too glorious. It's too fucking glorious. Lads boys, lads. Oh god, this is literally too glory. I'm getting a little bit excited <laughs> about this. Quad skulls incoming. No? Yeah. 
Yeah, because Doug shuts everyone down on the forums. Yeah, but he doesn't. He, he was. He's a lot more reasonable when he's actually talking, isn't he, than when he's in the forums. No, I forgot about him. But he's still. He can get in for a foul on that wall dancer at the end. And then knockdowns. Did he? Did he even roll this? I didn't catch that. I actually didn't catch that, but that's that's that would be really helpful. <laughs> He can he can bang on him, can't he? Make it well. Be pretty good. Oh, there in case it's not an AV break. Not much value in a stun here, is it? So, not great. Not a great foul, but still. Yeah, sent off for a stun. Maybe I shouldn't have done it. I think it's worth fouling when when you get sent off for a stun. I guess it does. Actually, the stun did, does enough, doesn't it? It makes him safe from the strip next turn. He just won't be able to reach next turn for the strip. So maybe the stun was alright, actually. <laughs> now, to be fair, the, the stun is actually good, isn't it? Because one, two, three, four, five, double G. If I just got to get the ball to here, and then he can't, he can't be stripped. I don't hate the person though, VIP Mr. Yemen Dem. That's the thing, I really don't hate the person. You know? That's it. I really don't hate Dole, the actual human being. <laughs> Get some more subs. I could get a could get a gym foul in molten. That'd be pretty good, wouldn't it? All right, so I need to be there because getting based is all right, isn't it? Because he's a fucking war dancer. Can we roll the hit counter? Can greed it up? Oh baby! <laughs> Get fucked on! Yes. Thank you, squirrel dude. <laughs> yeah, it seems like that little buzz, yeah. Yeah, I hate the forum. I hate forum terminator dough. That's what I hate. I could get rid of that one, no one seems to use that, that's right.
Yeah, that's true. Last Frozen is very rare. I like it though. I really, I'm really proud of it. But yeah, I've never seen it used. Yeah. But I'd rather try and get more emotes. <laughs> <laughs> That does seem a huge delay in chat, yeah. Yeah, because everyone said the standard foul way after. Seems a huge delay in chat, yeah. And I haven't changed any settings or anything. I don't hate Kanor at all. VIP by case. XVIP by case. <laughs> It's just that he's wrong and he won't he won't listen to anybody, will he? He won't listen to people who know better than him. <laughs> he'll, he'll listen to the Blood Bowl Rules Commission because they have the data <laughs> to, back, <laughs> to back up their assertions. <laughs> you know? And it's like... I don't know. I really hate that that fucking Gal Gallic Star Scraper. Paul Anders wouldn't give up about the bank rule because you know if he had just given it given it up, we'd be all right. Yeah, exactly. Have that, and it's just better. Yeah, fair enough. No, I haven't changed anything, Mr. Yemenden. I haven't changed anything at all. Yeah, I didn't know the canal quote was out of context. This is the thing, Squirrel Dude. I was talking and everything as well, right? And I was looking at my chat and I was looking at Andy's chat. And I just looked at Kanor's quote, so I wasn't I wasn't attacking Kanor because some people will think that, and and that was the thing. But yeah, I couldn't help myself about TV Plus, could I? But I thought I thought, look, considering what I could have said about TV Plus. Um, I thought it wasn't that bad. <laughs> but now I've figured it out, I'm gonna fucking do a graph. I'm gonna do a graph so I can uh, so I can show Dode exactly how wrong he is. Um, not that Dode will listen to it at all. Um, but you know it will make it clear. Maybe it's for other people who aren't Dord who think it's a good idea. It will make think it's a good idea. It will make it clear to them why it's not a good idea. Gotta go for this symmetry. Save that as free and I don't oh no, I do I need to split the line, don't I? He's he does have a catch, he's got he's got Eldril, so he could do a one turn, but I don't think he knows how to do it. Based on how he's played. I mean he could have seen a guide online. He could have done. But um this isn't even that bad anyways, he's gonna make some dodges. Yeah. XVIP. <laughs> Are you XVIP? Oh, I don't know. Was somebody else then. Sorry then, Vikings. Sorry, VIP Vikings. It was somebody else the other day that was an XVIP. <laughs> I'm fucking everything up. I need to write down the VIP so I know who actually is currently a VIP and who isn't. I do apologise. Um, yeah, the big delay. I don't know why the big delay has happened. I really don't know why it's happened. Um... Yeah, fair enough. And I think the thing about TV Plus as well is it does give a huge advantage to, like, Crucifer. <laughs> or if anybody who would put in the games at the start of the season. That's the thing. Um, that's the thing, isn't it? Because then the TV Plus is can't get him TV disadvantages. 
So he's got the TV advantage and TV Plus just isn't doing anything. So it does give a huge, huge advantage to early, people who play early. Um, that that is the that is a problem with actual TV Plus as it is now. My my complaints about TV Plus are to, honestly more to do with the theoretical TV Plus, full TV Plus, which Dode endorses and shouldn't. Oh, it looks like he did know how to do a one turn. Well, at least he was going to try. I don't think he did know how to do one, but it looked like he was going to try anyway. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Spoiled, yeah. All right, glorious, glorious VIP by Cakes. Still VIP. I, I, I don't know how I can fix the delay. I don't know how I can fix the delay. Maybe just stop the stream and start again. I haven't changed any settings at all. So, the whiz is gone, yeah. Pretty good. I guess I'll just restart the stream after, after this game here. Get it. If I go like that, he can just surf the guys on the sideline with Eldril. I guess I could put the shitters on the sideline. And then killers. Put these here. Shit is there. Warriors there. So it'd get kind of hard for him to do anything then, wouldn't it? I'll put these here. Oh dear, I can't. Would he even know to go for the surf? I don't know. Even if he does, so fucking what? He's got to commit to do it, and he's got to give up a mighty blow hit on Elbow to do it. That's like when you got big boy. Oh yeah. Might be Twitch side, yeah, maybe, yeah. yeah. I don't know, little bars, I don't know. They might be doing it wind us up. Wind everyone up. I don't know I don't know why it can always four T V plus. But I'm um, I'm gonna look, I'm I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do bar charts that explain why Dode is wrong. <laughs> that would be brilliant. That was disappointing, wasn't it? Deny the LOS and then he just fucking gets the quick snap. He'll get a surf now, he'll get a surf the call guy maybe, fuck's sake. Maybe, maybe Dode is burned. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Sparho, it's so fucking dumb, isn't it? 
It is without a best faggot, yeah, but you don't need best faggot when you got big boy. Yeah. yeah, Wiz is seven. Wiz is. Oh, good, he's not doing it. No, he might do it. No, he can't do it. So, far, can he? Wiz, frenzy guy is activated. Now there's no need for a party because the point is it just makes it about luck, which is crap, isn't it? I don't wanna, I don't want to play coin tosses. I don't want to fucking play a coin toss simulator. I don't think anyone else wants to either, even the bad people. Oh, he's just gone for a big fucking fight here, hasn't he? <laughs> he's had the nightmare of having his whole team based, and he's just doubled down on it. <laughs> By uh, well, not based his whole team based. He he actually he had the LOS denied to him, and then rather than having the LOS denied, he just went he just went balls to the wall, which uh, I don't think was a good idea. But don't know whether he'll don't know whether he'll pay for it or not. Hopefully he'll pay for it. I think go for the lucky hit on the frenzy is not a bad play. Because he's pretty annoying. Eldred is annoying, isn't he? So I think it's worth, it's worth trying to take him. Good. Present fuck off. Um, get him back as a safety. Do I need him in there? I guess I don't really. Surely they didn't mighty blow and carry him through, maybe. <laughs> ah, hey, look, if I had tackle, I'd still just blitter. I'd, bl bl I'd blitter. The chance of me having the tackle in the right place would be low, and uh, I would still probably just go for the mighty blow hit anyway. <sighs> so. There we go. 
Well, you're the, you, you're the kind of person that needs to make your voice heard then, Squirrel Dude, because at the moment, it just looks like the people crying about it are the people that want easy wins, you know, like that's... And that, that's, that's what annoyed me, because the, 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 the post that I quoted, um, that I quoted Say, uh, not Sage, Kenor on, was actually the exact words that Dode was saying, you know? Like, I want easy wins by having a fair match against a noob, and it's like, well, yeah, obviously, in a perfect world, you would you would be you you would be able to match again with you would be able to control for resources and you would match people by skill and therefore it would be plays and luck that would determine the result and it would be a, it would be a pretty fair matching then wouldn't it but unfortunately that's not the case and you can't do it I can't actually get the ball with him can I, I don't think no. Do I even want to chain him? Do I want to blitz him? Yeah. Do I want to do some safe moves first? Maybe. I think that's about my limit of safe moves first. Try for the lucky pal. No. Yeah, okay. Maybe I could have accepted that double score with a bit less action, but then he might have been able to break away. I think Skuro means open. <laughs> or not, I don't know. Yeah, but there's, there's two different things though, right? There's, there's full TV plus and the TV plus matching that we have now. Full TV plus would be horrific and yes you would obviously you would you would match people by your tv plus standing then you know like so if you go so that that's that adds to a lot of the confusion that the fact that there's two tv pluses there's this tv plus matching that we have and the actual full tv plus now don't fucking wants full tv plus you know that's the sad thing he thinks it's a really good idea i think that's my biggest issue i think the tv plus um I think the TV plus matching isn't that destructive, you know? So, I, 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 you know, I'm, not, I'm not that against TV plus, the, 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 the TV plus matching I'm not that against, but I'm 100% against full TV plus. <laughs> Thanks, last program. <laughs> I'll, I'll tell big boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Stuffing faggot got stuff. 
Yeah, he cares. I mean, he does care. Yeah, he cares. He cares about everything and he tries. He's just... He's just like... He just doesn't know Blood Bowl, does he? That's that's the problem. And I don't think that's insulting him or anything. Mm -hmm. Trying to discern numbers, fun from the numbers, is, is wrong. But even then, I can prove I'm right with numbers. <laughs> Well, not actual numbers, but with pretend numbers. Oh, God. This little fuckhead. I knew he'd dodge out that way as well. It's pretty annoying. Should maybe put another player in there or something. Brought him up to there. Maybe this is the game that I get punished for not having a tackler. Start the turn with that. At least he can't score with it. This turn. GFI and uh, could foul him. Good foul. That was the weakness of taking the sweeper away, wasn't it? And then he opened up the switch to this side a bit. And I didn't, I want, because I wanted to get somebody up here to stop that. So the really the foul cost a lot to do. But on the other hand, it did get rid of a powerful scoring threat. slamming now and hope it's enough
a lovely Christmas present just then. Right. This is tough, isn't it? I've got to fucking... Can I run around? One, two, three, four, five, six. Double gear fight to hit. I guess we go for that. And in combination with, like, safe moves, etc. Hopefully it's enough. Not really looking like it's enough at the moment, is it? Maybe I just blitz and base the ball and then get this guy around. Blocked myself, haven't I? That was pretty dumb. He can react. Oh no, I guess I've got to just get him in. Yeah, I wouldn't have hit, I wouldn't reroll the hit on the ball, but obviously I've got to reroll the GFI, haven't I? Yeah, double one it, great. Why did I even fucking try? And that was the GFI that I wouldn't have had to make if I hadn't blocked it, so it was my fault. Oh, fuck's sake. It's so annoying, isn't it? Fucking lose focus for one fucking turn. Come back. One square wrong means one additional GFI, which is a double one, which is just, you know... Fucking shit, actually quads ones. So actually if I hadn't done it, I would have got quad ones. I would have just quad schooled when I hit the ball. <laughs> that would have been pretty crap. <laughs> that would have been pretty crap. And a fucking quad school there. Uh, I don't know about family I don't know what the game would be like. I would like to play Euro Truck Simulator again. I'm very afraid as hell. Do you know what? This guy might have just gone for a two-turn score if I'd let him. Maybe I should have just not bothered. This is the danger against L's, isn't it? You know, if I'd just like... This is why I think Inarion's got the wrong strat, you know? Because if this guy had scored in two, I would have won for sure, I think. But now it's a bit fucking dodgy, isn't it? Ah, you got to be all one in six, haven't you? Like, I, w I wouldn't have re-rolled the block if it was a push or whatever. I'd have been alright with that, but... I just can't stop him rolling some dice. It's the fucking thing, isn't it? Like, obviously anyone can roll dice, but... Wood Elves can roll dice with a good chance of succeeding. <laughs> I like putting the guard in there so we couldn't make any blocks and he can get served. Right, let's not <laughs> fail GFIs to base the ball. Blitz can be on him.
I'm doing 4 3 2, or is it better to go here and then it would be a, a 4 3 3 2? That's better, isn't it? Yeah. Elves are fucking annoying, aren't they? Just quietly. Elves are like fucking annoying. Yeah. Or lose depending on opponent competence, yeah. Yeah. The ogres are number one ogres, yes, uh, glitch 86. Yes, the ogres are number one. <laughs> number one ogres. Goblin Spy has been updated recently, so uh, it's easy to find out that the ogres are indeed top ogres. Yeah, like, look, Inarian, obviously, look, Inarian's way isn't so crazy because he's obviously much better at playing defense than this guy. And obviously, Inarian's strategy is much better against uh, against poorer players because it does let him rack up the scores and everything, the defensive touchdowns. But, and it makes his offense super, even though it doesn't make his offense super reliable. But if he, if he changed it a little bit so he just scored at the earliest turn that he could without rolling any dice, it would make his offense super reliable because you can't stop Woody scoring you can stop them scoring on turn eight you know you can try to kind of try and force them to score earlier or whatever but you can't really stop Woody scoring unless they're unlucky or, or you know they're really bad whatever so but you know isn't really bad so you can't really stop them scoring with his woodies so it takes all the all the all the pressure off his offense and then he is good on defense so like it works for him but i i do think as a strategy it's somewhat flawed. No, Big Book Brothers didn't. They just uh, played one more game than Big Book Brothers. I think the Big Book Brothers are 8 2 4, and uh, Pro Tips Ogres are 8 3 4. So that, that draw still increased the rating. Oh, man, look at this fucking leap. Smooth leaps over him. Two dice is in. That, I knew that was the weakness that. Having him in the middle meant that I wasn't be I won't be able to catch him into the GF. But I guess I don't re-roll them this time. Oh that was good. Maybe he'll re-roll it. <laughs> oh well. That double one kind of equals my double one before, doesn't it, I guess? So this kind of makes it hard for to go forward, doesn't it? Right, no re-rolls. Just try to get lucky. Oh yeah. <laughs> now, he, now he probably just fucking gets served, doesn't he? <laughs> And then the strength four guy can get them, hopefully. Yeah, go there to make it just harder to go forward. Eh? Yeah, 
Yeah, fine. Like, yeah, there's 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 a lot of plus points to it. There's a lot of plus points to it, you know. But um, yeah, maybe a foul on him would have been good. This guy, these guys could have swapped positions. Maybe got a foul. On. But I mean, he hasn't got dodge on them, so and one's a loner, so like. If he's relying on them, it's not that reliable, is it? And I can blitz one, so he's got to get them both out to make them relevant. And he's got to get them both in range this turn. So, but yeah, maybe a foul one of them would have been worth it. Yeah, you're right. Bearing in mind, this is turn 15. So yeah, yeah, I guess that was a good shout. Good shout, Carl Ancelotti. Very good shout. Probably should have just fouled this guy. Then he's, he would be his only scoring threat. Probably the Wardens is a scoring threat as well. Isn't it? With maybe the GFI or two. Or four. Right, now he's down to one scoring threat. Maybe this maybe this board answers a scoring threat. What if he does that? I guess you should find, yeah, because armor seven sucks. Oh man, look at this. It's giving a leap and everything. Oh, fuck off. Oh, thank god. I pulled a perm. I pulled a perm. 22nd of December 2017. Apothecary to death. <laughs> it actually worked. <laughs> Outrageous. He's scoring threat now, isn't he, unfortunately? Yeah, he is. He's only got one scoring threat at the moment. He's got it. Oh, it's a wood elf throw or a pro elf throw. I'm a sick. Yeah, you got to get rid of him then. Right, so making rely on him is better, isn't it? Than, uh, than not. Three dice on the ward answer is acceptable. Unfortunately, it needs two push. It needs. I could get two pushes because I could push him into another push, then he's out. So actually, two dice is enough, isn't it? Guess I should have moved these two on here first. Push for him and he's out. Yeah. <sighs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Holy shit. Right, he's out of range. Try to tag the ball. Wow, they've only played one game to turn the TV down. That's crazy, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, oh yeah, that is that is there is a lot of luck down there.
Oh, Muldy D. Oh, Muldy. Good timing, Muldy. <laughs> glorious. Glorious emotes there. Um, I have a question. I have a question to ask you. Um, Muldipster, I remember you were like learning French or something and you were streaming it using some kind of tool on the internet. Um, could you tell me what program you were using to learn a foreign language with for free? You said it was free as well, I believe. Because I would like to learn on the internet how to speak German for free. <laughs> it's still not even that bad, I know, but at least he's got... At least he's got... Um, yeah, I was thinking of putting two there, but then I thought it was three plus two plus L, but the frenzy. Yeah, he's just gonna fucking do it, isn't he? At least he's got loner, so you know he's gotta make you three two pisses with loner. You can be mine. Yeah, thanks Mayu for the uh, for the host. He's fucking made the loner. Hey, he failed the one! Oh man, he passed the loner but failed the GFI. Oh, thank fuck for that. Thank fuck for that. Yeah, that was the thing. It was the fact that he was alone, it wasn't it, meant that it wasn't... wasn't so bad. Okay, now. Fucking woodies, man. It's unfair, isn't it? Should not use dodge to give me a chance to win. <laughs> ah, it's giving me a foul, eh? Where is that? Oh, there's one there. Oh, there's one there. Good manners foul to end the game, buddy. Say that cunt, I mean unlucky. <laughs> oh, Yuri Styles. Yeah. Um, the, the problem is, is that I, I'm not even sure it would work on the laptop, so I'll have to wait till I'm back in in Germany. But um, or if I can get the PC back anyway, some other way. But yeah, oh, he's on forty now. Pan Orgos is a beast, isn't he? <laughs> um, the Han Top Girl has no sign of Zamp any games, to be honest. Um, you talk up. <laughs> um, they should all learn English, but unfortunately, not all of uh, Senai's family and friends speak English, so. I can get by speaking English, but, you know, learning German would be better, wouldn't it? And if I want to become a German, thanks, Lil Vaz. I, I don't know how well played it was, to be honest. Obviously, got lucky killing his tree and that, and then grinding down the score. I think I played okay, but on defence, maybe maybe could have played better. Um, oh, Mr. Throw finally does it. He's finally, he's finally got the magical piling on. I'm not even going to consider guard, but I'll pretend that I'm considering guard. <laughs> but you know, you know it's fucking piling on. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about guard when I can take piling on. Um, maybe just keep it 11 for one game and then hope that present if I go, you know, want, no one else will die. No one will die. Right. Game number 21. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. 
and stay fantastic.